Happy birthday. You're 18 now. Make a wish and blow out your candle. I don't have to be nice. Good. Here, it's a little gift. What do you say? Thank you. Put it on. Oh, look very nice. Pick something you want. I'm really going to get out of here, please. It's a little early for that. Pick something else. A TV. You have to own that. Clock. Time passes. Really weird time here. I can do that for you. See? You do something for me, I do something for you. Come over here. Dad, I... Dawn. Call me Dawn. Come here. That's a good girl. your first breath and every day since I am gladly providing and in return you have given your mother and I nothing but selfish disrespect this is what happens to ungrateful little girls Motherhood. It's the best thing that can happen to a woman. It gives you a sense of purpose. You're welcome. So, do you get a bigger office? Of course. Second biggest. I'm so happy for you. Well, I've been there ten years. I do deserve it. What's that? Mommy, Daddy, me, and my new old baby brother sister. Hmm. You know, soon there's going to be three of us. It's not too late to let us... Might it be possible that I'd be able to come down here and relax? Sorry, Don. Yeah, sure you are. Congrats on the promotion, Dad. Thank you very much, Amy. Does this promotion come with a raise? I was thinking maybe we could hire a private investigator. No. Why not? We've already gone to Florida. You spent $5,000. We're not going to waste any more money on this. Do you wonder what happened to her? Do you wonder if... If she's happy, maybe she's dead. I'm never getting up, Dawn. I'm gonna keep searching for her, and I don't care what kind of money it costs. We have a daughter right here. Merry Christmas. Thank you, Dawn. You're welcome. Oh my gosh. <gasps> oh, it's a television. What is a television? This is gonna be our window to the outside. Outside, where Daddy goes. Mm hmm. <laughs> we have a television. <coughs> no, no, none of these are for kids. I don't know how much to give her. Give her half. But what if it makes her worse? Or poisons her? Her temperature is 101 degrees. You and Amy got sick all the time. Your mother handled it. She needs a doctor. You're the mother now. You handle it. Hey! Hey, don't get that. Hey! She needs a doctor! I'm sorry, sweetie. Can you tell me a story? Once upon a time, there was a fairy princess. And she was in love with a handsome prince. And one day, Princess's evil father found out about Prince Christopher. And he was so mad that he chopped off his daughter's wings. And he locked her in a cave underground. And the princess was so lonely. And one day, her fairy godmother came and brought her a little girl to keep her company. And they were so happy. And she came back a couple years later, but this time she brought the little boy. What about good Prince Christopher? I think he's still looking for her. Uh, Amy. Hey, it's uh, Chris. 